Hello, I'm Lillian McAvoy, and I am a freshman at Central High School. How to get over a crush that can never end well. Step one, definitely don't write a how-to list, and especially don't write a poem. Only write a to-do list. To do. Stop thinking about them, stop writing about them. Side note, don't make a how-to list on something you don't know how to. Step two, in addition to not writing about them and how hot they are and how you want to see them right now, no, you shouldn't want to see them right now. Do not listen to the one song that makes you think of them as you are not writing a love letter to them with their name replaced with gender neutral pronouns as to sound relatable. But no one can relate to such anticlimactic, hopeless love you have. Step three, don't go on Instagram just to look at that one decent picture of them from years ago in some scenic place they traveled the world to see. I want them to travel the world with me. Step four, don't spend time with them, alone or accompanied even by parents or apparently friends, and never travel the world with them. Don't hug them outside of school every day. Don't ask yourself, should I go in for the kiss? I have a few times, somewhat successfully, but not today, because today, today, I am getting over him. Over getting your inner thigh rubbed in the back of a dirty public bus, over being the punchline of jokes, then receiving, accepting, an apology hug seconds later. Done with bus stop kissing and being ignored in the halls. Leave me hanging on all my high fives, Side note, just end it when your romantic first kiss, which is at a bus stop, is interrupted when a rambunctious motorist speeds down Dodge declaring, get a room, and he pulls back and says, oh, inappropriate not for school word. I hope I don't know them. No, Lillian, I didn't mean it like that. Step five is it now? when they have a special sexy smirk just for you in the halls, if he even observes my existence, remember, I exist amongst all the other thick ladies of the school. You are in too deep. Step six, if they only want sex and... What am I doing? Probably best to save yourself for someone that is not them. Step seven, if you really feel the need to write a poem, a how-to list, a love letter, or any to-do list, just do it and get it all out. And maybe you can get out. Maybe I can escape from my own trap.